left hand side, Oliver Solberg. Loeb on the right in the orange. And you can see there off the start line that there's rails developing where the studded tyres have been digging into the snow and ice. So you're kind of on rails with good traction all the way down to turn one. Here is Oliver. Pulls on the bar, gets the car sideways. Into the Husky loop. Christensen and Johnson there after their quarter final. Lobe under the bridge. Beautiful shot. Just fully opening up that front suspension. Now he's going to have an advantage here as they come to the halfway point. Oh, Lobe right to the wall. Solberg's advantage, 1.2 seconds. But it needs to be 3.2. He's got to have the megaest of mega second halves of this lap. Here he is. Decisive there whether to change gear or go for the handbrake. It's building up quite an advantage now. Whoa, is he round? Is he round? No, he's still going. <laughs> Takes out a bit of bank on the inside. That was Wonderful full, run this. Full commitment from Ollie. Now under the bridge. This is where Loeb will start to creep back in. And Loeb has done a brilliant job here. It's not going to be enough for Oliver Solberg. Out to the line, he might not even win the heat. Right oh. together at the line. It's identical. It's no identical. Way. They're going to down to thousands of a second on our decimal screen, and it's the same time. Dead heat, but it is Loeb who goes through after winning the first heat. I have goosebumps. That was absolutely spectacular. I don't think I've ever seen that before. 3.2 seconds, the advantage in the end.